Hey everybody, Lauren Doyle here, your favorite intuition and habits, mentor, teacher, and coach. And so today I wanted to address something that comes up a lot, kind of like I always do. Um, And that is about summits and reaching this imagined goal that you have. And what I see a lot of times, especially when working with clients who are, you know, entrepreneurs um, or, you know, executive level type people who have these goals, you know, that's a part of you is having this drive to, to meet this expectation of yourself or be this highest level of yourself. And so there's like this comparative syndrome essentially that happens, right? Like some say it's an imposter syndrome, but I, I, I don't even think it's quite imposter syndrome. It's simply that you have a drive that's a part of you to be this incredible person and put the things that you want to put out there and, and really reach the amount of people that you want to reach with your with your amazing ideas, right? Like your creativity, the things that you know would help so many people. And um, what gets in the way a lot of times is there's this, this mindset, right? Or we've been sort of programmed into believing that there's this linear process to that, that it's just like, you know, what our grandparents did which is, you know, they, they went there to get a good job and then you climb the ladder and you, you know, you work your way up and you do all these things. And it's just not like that now. In fact, I don't even think then it was necessarily like that. It was to a certain degree, but, but there's, you know, take it from someone that was in the, the, the corporate ladder for a while. Uh, there's a lot of, you know, backstabbing and, you know, strategic jumps and things like that, that happen in order for those, those linear, um, climbs to occur. And when you're an entrepreneur or when you are, you know, someone who operates in an executive level, um, it just doesn't happen that way. You know, there's, there's these leaps and bounds and these jumps and, and you have to, you have to go through personal transformation um, in order to, and personal development in order to reach those next levels. You, you have to do it because your business and your um, ability to have ideas and creative thought processes are deeply connected to your your ability to consistently transform and better yourself. Um, And so those things aren't going to happen if you're going to be the average Joe on the average street with the average house and the average family and blah, 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 blah. You're not, you know, it's just not possible for you to reach those heights with that, that kind of acceptance. And so people that are in this position get caught up with this mindset that that, you know, that they get frozen by the fact that they're not where they want to be. And, um, my, I guess, point of all this today is that those summits are, aren't a end point, right? So your desire to, to be amazing, uh, isn't wrong. And it isn't something that should be squelched at all. In fact, it's it's like one of your greatest assets, and it's and it is a part of you know that uniqueness of self is that drive to get that out there. That that drive to get that out there is essential. It's an essential piece for you to 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 reach those pinnacles. And. Um, that those summits again are are not endpoints. They're movable, and they're they're you know instead of a mountain with one peak, it's a it's a mountain with multiple peaks with multiple trails there. And you can reach the summit of one thing that's a goal, and still you know be able to make a lateral move to reach a sub a summit that's another goal. 
and it's kind of like the culmination of all of those things and you in the process of doing that is what will make you that super successful with that i will see you tomorrow and know that those summits are not linear goals they're multifaceted and you being on that path is a huge part of the puzzle and is a part of you that is unique and wonderful bye